skyrocketing 86% in January, shares of fuel cell energy have subsequently come down to earth over the past two months. In February, fuel cell energy stock dropped 18%, and it slid even more, about 15% in March. Besides the company's disappointing first quarter 2021 earnings report, a Wall Street analyst's bearish take on the stock moved investors to pair their positions. Today, we will give you Fuel Cell Energy FCEL stock update and analysis. Number six, Fuel Cell Energy stock forecast for 2021. Interest in clean energy stocks has soared this year, driven by low interest rates, improving economics, and the election of Democrat Joe Biden, who has proposed to spend as much as $2 trillion on fighting climate change to the U.S. presidency. While solar and electric vehicle stocks have been the most high-profile winners, another theme that appears to have caught investors' interest is the concept of the hydrogen economy, or the use of hydrogen as a fuel for transportation and other energy requirements, replacing fossil fuels. In less than four months, the price of fuel cell shares has multiplied by more than 10 times. President Joe Biden's win caused a rally in clean energy stocks since he promised throughout his campaign that he will spend billions in pushing the United States towards environmentally friendly energy sources. As a result of this boost, the market capitalization of this money-losing company with less than $100 million in revenues jumped to nearly $10 billion at one point, while its valuation has nearly halved since that February 2021 peak. It is still enjoying a remarkably stretched market cap of $5 billion, despite the fact that revenues have continued to decline year over year. Meanwhile, the company posted a wider-than-expected loss during its first fiscal quarter of 2021, which caused a single-day correction as market participants seemed to be increasing their level of scrutiny for firms in the clean energy space after recent developments related to one fuel cell's rival, Plug Power, PLUG. Number 5. Fuel Cell Energy Stock News only a few days ago, fuel cells rival Plug Power informed investors that it will be performing important revisions in its accounting that will have an impact on the company's financial results covering 2018, 2019, and the first three quarters of 2020 as a result of certain practices that have possibly misstated the true financial picture of the firm. The combination of the market-wide drop in equities derived from an uptick in U.S. Treasury yields along with the sector-specific news seem to have reversed the latest uptrend of clean energy stocks, with most exchange-traded funds in the space swinging to year-to-date losses during the period after posting double-digit gains during the first couple of months of 2021. Meanwhile, analysts' fuel cell energy stock predictions seem to have also been affected by the company's latest financial report, which covered the first quarter of its 2021 fiscal year as the firm reported wider than expected losses of $0.08 cents per share versus $0.04 cents per share the market had expected for the period. Net losses landed at 46.76 million during the three-month period, representing a 14% jump compared to the same period last year, while revenues declined 9% at 14.88 million. By the end of January 2021, the firm had $210 million in unrestricted cash, while its long-term debt currently sits at around 110 million. Interestingly, Plug Power posted negative gross profits during this quarter, meaning that the firm's revenues were not sufficient to cover the direct cost of rendering the firm's services. Number 4. Analyst Forecasting for FCEL Stock in 2022 Firstly, the general consensus from analysts on the stock has a mean downtrend of 50.7% according to the current trading price. Among four notable Wall Street analysts, three have listed hold ratings and one sell rating. These include J.P. Morgan Chase & Company. J.P. Morgan analysts dropped their 12-month price target from $10 to $9 a share. 
JP Morgan has rated the stock as underweight with a sell rating, having a minimum impact on the share price. Canaccord Genuity analyst Jed Dorsheimer boosted the 12-month price target from $8.50 to $15, decreasing the downside from negative 50.84% to an upside. The rating was set as a hold and was noted that the move was a validation call. This price target has had a high impact on the share price. Jeffrey's Financial Group analyst Lawrence Alexander boosted their price target from $11 to $15, resulting in an increase of 36.36% from the original price target. The stock is still set to have a downtrend of negative 43.2% and has been rated at a hold. Cowan & Company analyst Jeffrey Osborne boosted their share price from $6.50 to $15.50 for an increase of 138.46%. The stock has been set at a hold, matching the consensus of other analysts. In summary, the price targets give investors one point of data to consider with FCEL stock. The consensus is neutral with majority of recent price targets within the current price range FCEL is trading at. Number 3. Analyst Price Target for FCEL Based on six analysts offering 12-month price targets for fuel cell energy in the last three months, the average price target is $10.63 with a high forecast of $13.50 and a low forecast of $9. The average price target represents a 23.89% increase from the last price of $8.58. On average, Wall Street analysts predict that fuel cell energy share price could stay at $9.90 by April 20, 2022. The average fuel cell energy stock price prediction forecast is potential downside of NA for the current FCEL share price of $9.71. Until FCEL can start demonstrating consistent growth, it should be treated as a trading vehicle rather than an investment. However, investors should keep FCEL on their radar as it's attempting to solve a major problem for utilities that could result in major earnings growth down the road. Number 2. Fuel Cell Energy FCEL Stock Buy or Sell? Fuel Cell Energy has seen an incredible amount of growth on Wall Street the stock has gained 1,084% over the past year of trading. FCEL, alongside its competitor Plug Power, have gained investor confidence, partly due to the congressional passage of an alternative fuels tax credit through the Biden administration bent towards renewable energy. Furthermore, alternative energy has been a major trend on Wall Street, pushing EV and clean energy stocks into new unseen territories. However, analyst price targets and ratings do hold some weight for the bears as the general consensus of FCEL stock is a hold. Data from MarketBeat indicates that two out of the five analysts covering the stock are currently rating it a sell with no bulls in sight. Notably, the 12-month consensus price target is currently sitting at $8.50 per share, representing a 43% downside potential based on Friday's closing price. Recently, Coster, the JP Morgan analyst mentioned earlier, lowered his price target for the stock from $10 to $9 while reiterating his sell rating. This move contradicts that of Canaccord Genuity, which the firm recently upping its price target to $15 per share almost twice their previous forecast of $8.50 per share while reiterating their hold rating. Still, another analytical source, Wallet Investor, seems bullish about their FCEL stock forecast 2021-2025. They give an $18.066 medium price target for the next 12 months, considering fuel cell a good long-time investment. According to their FCEL stock forecast 2025, the stock's price will rise up to $28.441 in a five-year period. Fuel cells have a built-in advantage of portability, a property which could ameliorate much of the uncertainty surrounding EVs on long trips. 
The need for plug-in stations should, at least in the short term, remain, thereby doing little to change the current charging station layout. Number 1. Fuel Cell Energy Earnings and Revenue Growth Forecast Fuel Cell Energy's forecast annual earnings growth rate of NA is not forecast to beat the U.S. industrial industry's average forecast earnings growth rate of 28.82%. And while it is not forecast to beat the U.S. market's average forecast earnings growth rate of 21.47%, Fuel Cell Energy's earnings in 2021 is negative $98,116,000. On average, six Wall Street analysts forecast FCEL's earnings for 2021 to be negative $92,435,618, with the lowest FCEL earnings forecast of negative $103,171,949 and the highest FCEL earnings forecast at negative 67,706,592. On average, six Wall Street analysts forecast FCEL's earnings for 2022 to be negative 53,746,137, with the lowest FCEL earnings forecast at negative 70,930,715 and the highest FCEL earnings forecast at negative 41,913,604. In 2023, FCEL is forecast to generate negative 41,107,573 in earnings, with the lowest earnings forecast at negative 54,810,098, and the highest earnings forecast at negative 16,100,000, 20,617. Fuel Cell Energy's forecast annual revenue growth rate of 32.42% is forecast to beat the U.S. industrial industry average forecast revenue growth rate of 12.44%, and it is also forecast to beat the U.S. market's average forecast revenue growth rate of 14.56%. Fuel Cell Energy's revenue in 2021 is $69,484,000. On average, five Wall Street analysts forecast F-Cell's revenue for 2021 to be $25,591,157,155, with the lowest F-Cell revenue forecast at $21,214,732,038. And the highest FCEL revenue forecast at $29,626,470,014. On average, five Wall Street analysts forecast FCEL's revenue for 2022 to be $37,614,558,175, with the lowest FCEL revenue forecast at $33,466,400,996. And the highest FCEL revenue forecast at $48,155,507,252. In 2023, FCEL is forecast to generate $52,616,726,814 in revenue, with the lowest revenue forecast at $44,267,214,458. And the highest revenue forecast at $69,238,050,230. Do let us know in the comment what are your thoughts about the future of fuel cell energy stock. Please subscribe to the Stock Advisor. Thanks for watching.